Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get started. In today's video you will find out how the price of Bitcoin has changed and what the technical indicators SMA, EMA, Divergence and MACD are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. By taking a closer look at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, the price went down only slight by about 0.2% in the last 24 hours and has a current price of 21,269. Jumping to the hourly simple moving averages, the current price is above all simple moving averages for this time interval, which looks bullish and it is to watch if the closest SMA, the 50 SMA could hold support or the price will break it to the downside below the current price of around 21,268. Important to note is that the price is currently above the 200 SMA, which can play as a strong support. However, breaking it decisively to the downside will signal a potential big move down. Moving to the hourly exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is above the hourly ribbon, which can be perceived as bullish and the ribbon could play as a support. This means that you should watch if the price could bounce off the ribbon. The current price to watch is around 21,147. Nevertheless, a trend change can be expected owing to the ribbon being compressed, which means that the trend is currently not very strong. Usually, when the price moves to the side, the ribbon is less reliable. On the lookout for divergences in the hourly time frame, there was a bearish divergence and the price already went down. Jumping to the hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. But it's expected for the price to remain the same for some time because the MACD histogram shows that the momentum at the moment is shifting upwards. You should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. Jumping to the three hourly simple moving averages, the current price is above all simple moving averages for this time interval which looks bullish and it is to watch if the closest SMA, the 20 SMA could hold support or the price will break it to the downside below the current price of around 21,191. Jumping to the three hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is above the three hourly ribbon, which is generally bullish and the ribbon could play as a support, so it is to watch if the price could bounce off it. The current price to watch is around 20,830. The support should be considered because the ribbon is more or less spread out. Jumping to the 3 hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently strong and it could be expected the price to go further to the downside. Looking at the daily simple moving averages, the current price is between the 100 and the 200 SMA. If the price bounces off the 100 SMA which is currently at 20,703 it could be seen as a support and the 200 SMA that is at 24,080 could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. Jumping to the daily exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is above the daily ribbon, which can be perceived as bullish and the ribbon could play as a support. This means that you should watch if the price could bounce off the ribbon. The current price to watch is around 20,185. However, the ribbon is compressed, which means the current trend is not very strong and the trend change could be expected. Generally, when the price moves sideways, the ribbon gets less accurate. Moving to the daily MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently strong and it could be expected the price to go further to the upside. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.